<laughs> Sorry. like 14 degrees but sunny so that's what makes it feel so much hotter out oh I can't believe it it's um what is it October 16 2022 and it's uh, 10 to 11 I don't think I'm ever gonna leave here it'll be a week tomorrow that I've been here and I've been trying to edit a video but it's just so beautiful out. There's a little rabbit that's uh, that's been hanging around my van. He lives in here, or she lives in here somewhere. Right around the slide, it's hanging around. It's so adorable. Tomorrow I've got therapy, but I might do it um, on FaceTime so that I don't need Wi-Fi. I can use my own data. Because, mm. yeah, this is just too too heavenly to want to leave. So serene, so quiet and calm, peaceful, everything you need for healing. Mother Earth, yes, she provides everything. You just have to learn to spend some time alone. It's hard to do, I know. But now it's my preference. I'd much rather be in nature than in front of a computer. feet again. I just finished washing my feet. Water's not too cold. I can wash my feet this way. And I see my shotgun shell right here. See that? Just right here. And isn't that beautiful? just gorgeous. It's like a postcard picture right here. I don't know what I like better. The crunchy leaves on my feet or the smell of them. Oh, they smell divine. I like walking in the tall, soft grass. I love walking in the warm sand. And I even enjoy walking in the wet sand. Leaves are falling off so fast. I'm gonna relax on the swing for a little bit and then I'll get some work done. Oh, I see what they were doing. Those trucks, those trucks were putting in a new road. We got a new road here, road in Davignon Park. Wow, that's cool. I'll get a video of that when I leave. But for now, the wheels go round in circles. <laughs> yeah, it just. Oh. I could fall asleep. I got a carrot for you. Are you interested in a carrot? 
my friend Dean thinks that he's domesticated. And I would have to agree with him because I don't think a wild rabbit would let you get this close. I mean, I'm seriously... Six feet away. Here. You really like those clovers. You like them better than a carrot? Hey? You want a carrot? Hey. Honey. Here. Not interested. Here. Oh my god. Yeah. Here you go. You want that? Come get the carrot. Here. You want the carrot? I got another one over here for him, but he's not interested. Hi. How come you don't like carrots? Hey? Why don't you like carrots? See, I got another one there. One here. And, uh, yeah, he's not interested. What are you doing, little guy? What are you doing? What are you doing in there? You think I can't see you? It's 5.40. So the sun's setting. It's just so beautiful. So peaceful. Let's see for the sunset. Is that good? Is that good? <laughs> Hi. Hi. He doesn't like carrots at all. Not at all. He shits on it, see? <laughs> Hi. He's right beside me.
doing? What are you doing? Hey? <laughs> Hi. You're not that afraid of people, are you? Oh, he's leaving. <laughs> See you later. See you later. Cutie. Good cutie. He's okay. It's now Monday. I've been here a week today. It's going to be like this all day and raining later on this afternoon and calls for rain again tomorrow. So even though I don't really want to, I have to head into concrete jungle, upload a video, get rid of some garbage, lots of garbage. But Dean ended up catching that rabbit. It was uh, domesticated. It was very obvious. He could eat you know, his uh, first attempt, like first real attempt. Sorry, somebody's doing some work across the street there. But um, in his first attempt, he was able to catch the little rabbit. And so, uh, yeah, he brought it home and he already had a cage and everything set up. So now he's gone to get some supplies for it. And it's kind of like a bittersweet, you know. I had so much fun with it last night. So I knew it was just a matter of time before you know, it was caught by a predator or froze to death because it's not, you know, you can tell, well, a domesticated rabbit's not going to be able to survive the elements. That's for sure. And so I was so happy when, um, you know, just without hesitation, he, you can tell he wanted to get it and bring it home so it would live because he knew the same thing, that it wouldn't survive out here. So that tells me a lot about his heart. And that's what I like. I like people with kind hearts that are, you know, considerate to Mother Earth and and all living creatures. It's just so beautiful here. So I just find it so I can hear my like my own thoughts. Like my thoughts are not being hijacked like they are when you are around civilization, you know. But when you're with Mother Earth, like she doesn't hijack your thoughts and. It's just a beautiful thing, and that's the only way you're ever going to be able to heal, heal is by spending time alone. And the easiest way to heal your inner child is to be in nature. Mother Earth will help you. That I know. Oh, I'm so grateful for this. I really am. But yeah, cheers to peace, love, and light.
guys. Good morning. Well, I stretch and stretch. Okay, just stop to say hello and good morning. <laughs> Cowbell. I haven't heard cowbells in a long time. hardware store here <laughs> oh, but anyways yeah it's their hardware store and uh, this place beautiful but I uh, really love this tavern that's in the corner here I'm going to show you it, it just is such a beautiful building I love churches too but this one right here. Like, look at that. You know, back in the day, a little tavern downstairs and then upstairs is rooms and stuff. Look at this, eh? Just lovely. Look at how close this house is. I mean, it's literally on the sidewalk. Look at that. Isn't that something else? <laughs> and their door is just right there. That would be illegal today, right? Look at that, a train's coming.
So right over there is where I want to go to Walmart, but I have to make a U-turn because the water's back there. See, like what I'm gonna do right now. Okay, let's just. So I'm gonna get rid of my garbage, um, fill up my water. And they don't have a sign up here yet saying when they're closed. I think I'm gonna head back to uh, Davion Park. They've been closing their restaurants because they're understaffed, all the kids are back in school and nobody wants to work anymore because, you know, well, that's the way it is. As you can see, I had to go for the drive-through because the restaurant is closed. So, but there's my coffee waiting for me. And I don't know what I'm gonna do because there's no sun means no solar. No electricity. I don't know how I'm gonna edit my video. Somebody is in my spot. That's exactly where I normally park. Some bitch. <laughs> oh well, I guess it's a universal sign. Do not park there, so I'll just go over towards the front here. And There's also a dollar ram on this plaza, but no matter how many freaking stores there are, I'm still miserable because it's still concrete jungle. Okay, so here I am. I would rather be inside there because then I get free electricity and stuff and then I don't have to worry about, you know, how my my battery banks are being depleted, you know, like I'm going to have to do now. But because um, tomorrow it's going to be another day like this too. Anyways, I'm going to... Drink my coffee here, extra large, it was free. Cheers. Mm. Yeah. So, I'm just editing a video. I'm trying to get this up today, which is that date right there. 